we did first with the agency, DDB, who's our creative partners. Uh, we actually went out and spoke to uh, dozens and dozens of uh, customers within this segment, people who would be buying cars, people who have bought cars, uh, people who would become eligible or become prospects in the near future. And uh, it's very interesting uh, what we found out over there because uh, we actually narrowed down our target segment to what we call as a bullseye target segment on the basis of this consumer work that we did. It's actually that, that turning point in a man's life where he is transitioning from let's say boyhood to adulthood or from adolescence to uh, let's say a matured uh, adult. And it's these moments in that life uh, that, that uh, defined why a car or, or like the Amio would find a fit with him in his life. So it's about the time that he's beginning to think about getting married uh, and therefore the need for a car that comes up. It's about telling his folks that he's now serious about life ahead and therefore the car becomes an enabler for him to demonstrate that to his parents and so on and so forth. So uh, that's the target segment that we identified, which we call as the 28 year old uh, turning point in a man's life uh, from uh, boyhood to adulthood. And, and, and that's that was the genesis from where the uh, campaign idea developed and uh, they, you've seen the creatives already are yeah. out. That again came out of a lot of consumer interactions on what is the kind of relationships. We also saw a lot of the advertising in the category. Uh, there seemed to be a fair amount of husband, wife and family car kind of a thing. And we said we needed to be a little different because, uh, you know, uh, getting lost in the sea of sameness was one of the uh, barriers that we saw getting in over here. And we found the father-son relationship to be a little unique because you had a lot of father, uh, mother, son, or man, wife, boyfriend, girlfriend, etc., being used, but the father, son was not really uh, used uh, in in the category. So we took that, and then we dive deeper to see what's the kind of relationships people share. And it's this son trying to prove to his dad that he's reached a certain uh, maturity uh, in his life, and the father is constantly looking for these symbols or these uh, signals to tell him that yes, my son has reached uh, a certain uh, a level of maturity or a certain uh, expectation that the father has that the son is delivering. Well, the response actually, uh, you know, we've been a late entrant in the segment. So the segment already had cars from virtually most of our competitors. Yeah. Uh, but one of the advantages coming in late is you can actually load the car with features that the other people don't have. Uh, this segment is pretty heavily a feature-driven uh, segment. Uh, so what we did is took a lot of the features that were existing, put that onto a car and topped it up with a, a lot of what we call as uh, segment-first or class-leading features that we brought into the car. And, uh, and these are the things that, that, have, that has worked uh, well for us from the consumer response or the media response that we see, as well as our dealers uh, have been commenting on it. Uh, the second thing about the car is that uh, the, a lot of the people had commented before we embarked on this journey that the design of these cars would not seem to be uh, too, uh, let's say, uh, with a fine degree of finesse in terms of a, a design. Uh, and we understood that because it is challenging within a sub four meter to build a what we call as a uh, three box car. Uh, it's it, it's tough, but I think that was the challenge that we took on ourselves. Uh, we got the best designers from our um, uh, offices in Germany, and we had this person down here who actually designed the car, a person called Thilo Klum, mm -hmm. and uh, it's fascinating how. Uh, the response to the design itself has been so overwhelming uh, that uh, people have really appreciated how this car stands out from the rest of the uh, cars in the, in the category.